would go underground, do their satanic shit, and sacrifice alive humans in here. I feel like it's kind of just slowly just building it up bigger and bigger until that one moment. <laughs> Looks like it's pulling you into like a portal, like another dimension. Dude, it looks like there's still like ash in there. That mother is just like you got a demon. It's a real thing that happened in here. He died in this elevator shaft. A bathtub down there, and then like a cage. Do you think they would keep people in cages here? It looked like there was four fingers just spread out like this under his hat. I'm crying right now, and I don't know why. Something just crawled across the floor from the beginning. Shh, listen, you're misinterpreting me. There's a big shadow flying over you. That sounded like the cream of hell. Oh my god. Did you just watch a spirit attach to me? You're it. You can't hide from me? No fing way. No! He turned you back! This is it going. I don't know how else to tell you. Leave. No, turn left, turn, turn. Whoa, is that blood behind you? What you doing? Half tense. What did it do? What? Hey, I wish I had a heart rate monitor on right now. I'm freaked the fuck out. I'm, I'm scared. I'm like, that's that what? what? Before this three hour video begins, I just want to let you all know that we have a brand new merch box that is available right now at SenateSociety.com. Ginger, can you pop it in here real quick? This box, all the designs have literally been designed for you. If you like this channel, if you like all things spooky, this is the ultimate one. So I have the Spirit Seeker shirt on right now. Ginger has the Haunted Hummies hoodie. Flip around to show the back, the bouquet design. I also have our Haunted t-shirt right here with the front design on it as well. And one more, Haunted Homies, the shirt in the back. All of this is literally one big box. It's two t-shirts, the long sleeve and the hoodie. The price, $66.60, which no one can argue with me is like by far the most affordable, lowest price merch in all of anywhere at all whatsoever. We do that because we want to make sure that everyone can like grab some stuff, get some cool designs, get some cool gear, rep the channel. We appreciate it and of course all of these boxes go straight back into this channel, making better videos, getting more ghost gear, traveling abroad because of course if you aren't already aware we did return to Suicide Forest there for three nights total plus some other locations in Japan. Those videos will be coming up next on this channel. Thank you guys so much for your support. By the way, this is Ginger. Uh, we're getting married soon. If you don't know who she is, now you do. Hi. She might, she might be in the Suicide Forest videos. I might be. I might have been scared. A lot of scared. But hey. <laughs> Someone else might have returned as well that you haven't seen on the channel in a while. Cool. Okay. Bye. Enjoy the video. Welcome back to the Overnight Channel. This is a two-night investigation in one location in one video. This is the Nazareth Hospital. It is seven stories high. It's huge. And finally, we got into the crematorium, which is over here to the right. I think this is going to go down as one of our most diverse, top to bottom, every form of paranormal activity, every type of entity, good, bad, evil, or unknown, poltergeist activity, we captured it on camera. Some of the most intelligent responses we have ever seen across every device. We went from super demonic poltergeist activity to playing tag with this little kid that we met named Rocket. Literally sent Corey running across the hall like a <laughs> lunatic, trying to tag the spirit, going back and forth, <laughs> back and forth. I think I won. <laughs> and then the basement. Oh. We started unraveling what some people have hinted at being a very dark force that lives within the bottom of this property. We think that we just got actual evidence of the spirits admitting that there were satanic rituals going on and they were burning people alive. There's a lot to unpack here because it hasn't really been investigated that much. Tonight's investigation may be the most remarkable one we have ever had. Not only were we physically attacked, but the attacks were confirmed by the entity here, bragging about what they were capable of, and the most clear, audible evidence we have ever captured while on the roof. We are only the second team to investigate here with full access, and I fear the ghosts here are only starting to seek their vengeance. Yet the hauntings of this particular building are deeply embedded within the history of the town itself, and what caused hundreds of thousands 
thousands of people to travel here, mainly those that were sick, dying, and searching for any glimmer of hope to survive. In 1880, the Lynch family drilled a well, and they claimed that the water had medicinal powers, which led many people to move to the town, establishing the name of Mineral Wells in 1877. One story in particular was in regards to a woman that began to regain her sanity from regularly drinking the miraculous water. Hence the name Crazy Water was born. It didn't take long for word to get out that the waters had healing powers. And by the early 1900s, Mineral Wells was on its way to becoming a national health resort, a time when they didn't have modern medicines or treatments. This was their best chance and hope. Traveling from all over the country, people were carried into town, pushed in with a wheelchair, or walked in with a cane. Whatever it took, they needed to get there, and many never made it back out of the town alive. During the 1920s and 30s, Mineral Wells was attracting over 100,000 people a year, and at the end of the 1940s, the days of the mineral waters were numbered. The FDA was established in the United States, and it was now a federal offense to make any claims of the medicinal powers of the water. By the 1980s, many of the old hotels and boarding houses had either burned down, fallen down, or simply torn down. Yet still standing are the Norwood Hospital, Nazareth Hospital, Crazy Water Hotel, and Baker Hotel, all within a half mile of each other. After the town's original sanatorium burned down in 1927, the new 46 room Mineral Well Sanatorium was built, and four years later, the Holy Sisters of Nazareth purchased the building, turning it into a hospital. The first floor, the basement, was the sanatorium, the tuberculosis ward, polio ward, the emergency room, and the morgue. Many of the patients diagnosed with mental illness also lived there. The second floor was the entrance and lobby. It also had the administration, procedure, and recovery rooms. The third Third floor contained the chapel, dining hall, and doctor's offices. Fourth floor housed the labor, delivery, and nursery rooms. The fifth had the surgical, ICU, and x-ray. And the sixth floor was the nun's quarters, with the top floor reserved as the priest's quarters. In order to cut costs, linens were said to have been used three times longer than they should have, along with other equipment. And by 1940, the Nazareth now had a need for its own crematorium, with a powerhouse and a resident engineer to keep it going 20 24-7, the day it was built until 1956. The sanatorium was suspiciously in the basement, directly next to the morgue, but 100 feet away from the crematorium. All other sanatoriums in the country were placed in sections with the absolute most sunlight. Waverly Hills is a prime example. And in this basement, it is rumored that they would frequently perform questionable medical procedures, leading to the deaths of patients. Although the experimental treatment and death records are nowhere to be found, Mineral Wells was nestled directly between the infamous Texas State Insane Asylum in Austin, Texas and the Northwest Texas Insane Asylum, both of which were known for lobotomies, electroshock and hydroshock therapy, with all other experimental treatments. In a city built upon any ounce of hope to regain their health, there is no limit to what people were willing to endure or volunteer for to have the slightest chance of living. Roughly 25 years after opening, the hospital closed its doors, now sitting abandoned. The total amount of patients who passed away at Nazareth are unknown, and how many passed away within this half-mile area is an even greater unknown number. And tonight, we will begin the search to see how many of those who passed away here still haunt the town. The Nazareth has countless paranormal occurrences over the last century, from doors and wheelchairs moving on their own, rapid drops in temperature, hearing cries of pain, lights being turned on and off in a building no longer with power. Shadow figures are seen playing all all throughout the building. The young girl spirit is known to play with the remaining toys, and even a ghost named Vern, known for tripping people on the stairs, and a lady in blue is frequently encountered near the nun's quarters, while the elevator shaft is haunted by a man that was crushed within its doors. Yet incredibly unique experiences have been documented here as well, such as the sudden smell of blood and incredibly loud hissing noises. This location greatly surpassed any expectations we had for it, leading it to be, in my opinion, the most remarkable investigation we have had yet, which is terrifying, as I truly believe we have barely scratched the surface of what entities still reside here below. Hey, can you please do me a favor? If you are messing with Elton, can you just touch this box one time and make it go off? Just to confirm that you're the one? Oh my God! Okay. It sounded like it wrapped up and around 
the building, like that. Because yeah. I heard it down low. Like I thought yeah. it sounded like a gurney or someone being dragged to the crematorium. about undrilling that we could possibly undrill this it changes your voice to like a you know i can undrill this right why the fuck would we hear hissing loud as hell and it gets picked up on there it's like a demonic voice talking and then screaming but it got pushed through to actually translate through our device yes this is funny this is ha ha you do it to me Exactly what I've been doing to my friend Corey when I walked in. Let's see here. We'll say hello. Hello. My name's Corey. I don't know if you remember me, but I've been here before. If there's any spirits or energies, entities, souls that want to talk with us tonight, we'd love to talk with you. Hello to everyone here. Last time we were here, we met someone that we decided to call Dr. Haha, -Ha, who was making me feel horrible while I was in this building. And anytime I tried to leave, it got even worse. Whatever, whatever it's worth, that experience you gave me that night was so incredible that the one and only time you decided to answer with certain devices were like precise answers. So we're hoping tonight that maybe you can communicate with us in a more friendly manner, in whatever way you want. And if there's any other spirits in here that we didn't get a chance to meet last time, maybe you as the head doctor here can introduce us to them or let them know it's safe to talk to us. Maybe you could be like our spiritual liaison our spiritual tour guide yeah yeah like introduce us you know what i mean like maybe show us around yeah i would love that too seriously if you could kind of walk us through this building show us what you want introduce us to your friends we'd love that can you imagine it takes us to a room he's like hey, this is tiffany we go over here we go here's jessica uh, this is dr ha ha <laughs> he's not a real doctor he just laughs at you <laughs> Do any of you guys have car keys on you? Why uh, yes? Dowsing rods are somewhere. Okay. But that's it, why? Not even car keys when you were introducing yourself. No, I think you, no, no actually dowsing rods are downstairs in the basement. There's nothing on us that jingle. No. Over there, I heard car keys go. When you were introducing yourself, I mean like, I don't know if you remember last time I was here, blah, blah, blah. And then I just hear, shh. This is a kid's board, by the way. Kids can't drive. <laughs> Sorry. You ever capture an apparition of a little girl in one of those like Barbie cars? Yeah. <laughs> those little like giant Hot Wheels just cruising down. Yeah, instead of the Shining on tricycles. Yeah, <laughs> the modern day instead of tricycles is two twins in a Power Wheels car. Okay, let's go upstairs. Maybe we can show each floor. Show like yeah. really how big this place is. Three times. Dude, we have been, we've had that since what, 2020? 2021? 2020? 2020? Yeah, I think this is like the first major tool I got. And then again, if you get that close to it, to set it off. Do you remember us? Is that it? Yeah. 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 Can you say one of our names? Can you tell us your name?
Thank you for coming. So like, thank you for coming. Were you someone that works here? Why is it so fast? I heard tag your it. Like a little kid. Yeah. Are there children up here? If it is children, let's go with it as the children until they prove to us that they can hold the door against you <laughs> and they are a demon. Okay. Or it was ten children holding the door. Let's say you can fight one demon. Okay. Right, you can. But you didn't even match one demon. How many children's spirits do you think you could take? So you and one demon even match, you're going toe for toe, no one's getting knocked out, you go all 12 rounds, it's a draw. You versus how many children's spirits? Now are they? It? Comment how many children's spirits you guys. I'm gonna say like 14, 15. 14? Yeah. Okay. Uh, what age? Uh, nine. Nine. Yeah. 14 nine-year-olds. Yeah. I feel like I could beat up 14 nine-year-olds. But you can't, you can't like. I can't kick them. I don't know. Can you? Oh, cause they're ghosts. Yeah, they're ghosts. Oh, then what? <laughs> <laughs> what, dude? 
to protect myself. Yeah, dude, one little kid could beat me up then. One of those staffs and you light sage on each hand and you're just like swirling it around. <laughs> Just. <laughs> it's a good idea. That was a really good sound. <laughs> you also sounded like a pug running full speed. <laughs> Three, two, one. If there's anyone in here that wants to play tag, those. Okay, stop. Wait, Dog. really? They lit up? That one and that one behind you, you lit up at the yeah. same time. That one. Really? Dude, and it was the one behind you. If there's anyone in here that wants to play tag... Okay, stop. Wait, Dog. really? They lit up? That one and that one behind you, you lit up at the yeah. same time. That one. Really? Dude, and it was the one behind you. Wait, so even behind me? Yeah. Because I saw the one over there. I saw that one and that one light up. Does that not sound like Venom here that wants to play tag? Wait, stop? Yeah. yeah. Right? Doesn't it sound like... Okay, you like ran around and then you're like, wait, it's not be exactly in time. Anyone here want to play tag? And that's why it went yeah, off. Yeah, that's why I triggered it. Yeah. Whoa. Okay. If there's anyone in here that wants to play tag, can you say you're it? Do you want to play a different game? Hide and seek? How many people want to play a game with us? Can you say the number? I'm gonna try and get lower in case you're a bit smaller. Is this easier for you to talk? I'll give you some points for our first game that we're gonna play if you can say hi. Ending. You heard that? The out there? Yeah, I heard a door slam. Uh huh. Okay. No! Let's go! Let's go, dog! No! Find you. What floor are you on? 
Do you only want to play tag with Corey? Did that just sound like someone flatlining? Yes. Yes, dude. I was going to say REM pod, but not REM pod. This sounded like someone flatlining. Bing. Yes. Directly below us. Do you only want to play tag with Corey? That's you talking, but hold on. Don't worry, you want. The only one to play tag is the coin. That's not what I'm finding. Again, right? Like, we hear the flat line, but this has to be something different. Don't worry, you want. The only one to play tag is the coin. That's not what I'm finding. Again, right? Like, we hear the flat If I run down and get the headphones, do you want to try Estes before we like leave this floor? Yeah. Okay, I can. I'll run down. I get all the way to the basement and back. Up? Yeah. Yeah. Are uh, you guys just stay up here? Okay. Okay. I'm gonna go all the way down to the basement. Yeah. Right. Because the headphones are. Yeah, they're all the way down there. Okay. All right. It's gonna take a couple minutes. I'll be alone in the insane asylum. No way. No way. No way. No way. No way. As you leave. Bro, what? Hi! Hey! Everyone that's watching knows that it's not going off until the very until I leave. Hello, friend. Hello, friend! It wants you it wants me out. Dude, what? Hello? Okay, I'll go get the headphones to the FS method. If anything happens to me, I have a body camera. I think I have another one. Can you hand me that body camera right there? Yeah, I'll take another one with me. Okay. I'm leaving, I'm leaving, I'm sorry. What? I, I, I don't even know what to ask right now. Did you want him to leave the room? Bob. Is your name Bob? Do you want me alone in here by myself? Okay, good. Evan, do you have any idea what, what it was just trying to say? As Elton's leaving, that starts going crazy, and then this says, hello, friend. Take it one out of two ways. One, it wanted Elton to leave, or two, it wanted to follow Elton. Wait, you think that's what it could have been? I mean, those would be my two best guesses. Please don't push me down the stairs. Please don't push me down the stairs. Oh my god. I mean, obviously you're not going to answer this if you did leave, but... Did you leave the room to go follow Elton? See my shadow. See my shadow. Dude, if he comes back up and says that he saw a shadow, how wild would that be? All of the, the rooms to work with. We're gonna leave this room pretty soon if there's no one up here. We really need you to touch that box just to let me know that I am still talking with you or we're gonna go ahead and pack up and leave and go downstairs. Hall. Hall. It just said hall. Okay, six more floors to go. Damn. 
Saw torture. Saw torture. Did you see someone get tortured? Whoa! Dude, that's the first time it's went off since you left. <laughs> Swear to God. No! Swear. No! Dude. What? I swear. The second I get to the top step, you want to talk to Elton? Is Elton your friend? What the f***? It really didn't go off for the entire time. I went all the way to the basement the and back. The entire time never went off. Dude, I just hit the top step. Can I come in the room? I'm gonna enter the room, okay? We have a new way to talk to you. And I even found this ball. Talking. Talking. It just said talking. What? Dude, that's, dude, it stopped. Okay, I have everything for S's right okay. with me right now. Toy. Toy! You like the ball? You glad that he brought a ball up here? I think they like you. I think whatever's up here right now is wanting to talk to you. Or we just happen to get the right things. <laughs> I, f I just found the ball when I was walking around. And I was like, oh, I'll bring it up if it's Joyce. If you want me to leave this room. My name is Mildred. My name is Mildred. Mildred. Mildred Joyce? Joyce is the last name. Hi, Mildred. Mildred, I'm going to step out of the room. If you want me to leave, can you make the box beep again? If it doesn't beep, I'll come back in. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, I'm coming back in. Okay. Two men here. Two men here. Okay. Hey, Joyce, Mildred, Bob. Are you up here trying to talk to us? If it's someone else and I didn't say your name, can you please tell him what your name is? I heard Michael. You're supporting Michael. Michael, are you the one that wants to play tag? Or Michael, were you a patient? Thank you for asking. Good job. You're doing a good job. Thank you. Do you know where the doctors are at? Oh, what was that? Oh, I was so fast, what was that? That was the most evil f***ing voice that I've ever heard in a spirit box. It's probably Dr. Ha Ha. If that was the doctor that he just heard, can you say Ha Ha? He doesn't want to anyway. He was a kid that went, he doesn't want you anyways. And no way. What? Dead? Yeah. What? And I was like, if it is Dr. Ha Ha that's up here, or I said, if it's the doctor, can you say Ha Ha? And then you go, he doesn't want you anyways. Cuts off. Wow. It went from full to half, and then half to a quarter, and then dead. And this has been sitting on the charger. Wow.
That's actually wild. Wait. Wait, it's back on. Wait. It's back on. Okay, I didn't, run. I didn't even touch anything. What? All right, run it. Yeah, let's, let's keep going. What? Who just turned that device off? Done. <laughs> of course. Dude, that's nuts. Does it's everything in fully charged? Do you th but Whoa! The second I, I sit up, the second I sit up, flashlight. Does it's everything in fully charged? Do you th but Whoa! The second I, I sit up, the second I sit up, flashlight. I'm gonna leave. Just, I'm just gonna walk down for like a minute. <laughs> it's like. You just got to do a fight of a couple, and you're like, okay, I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave. I'm going to go to my parents. Okay. I'm going to go for a drive. Okay. No, dude, I feel like the doctor wants to talk to you, not me. The hello friend, the box going off, that dying. He doesn't want to talk to you as I'm the one asking the questions. You want Corey to leave? Or do, you, do you want me here alone? Boom. I'm gonna leave so you can talk to Elton, okay? That's what you want, right? Dude. Watch everything starts going crazy. Okay. Good luck. Thank you. I didn't say that like you're... Wow. It went off. What did? Flashlight. No. You guys both went through the doorway, it instantly goes off the second you bolted the doorway. This is weird, dude. The precision is like scary. You know what I mean, Corey? Yep. Like the EVP on your head, the shuffling on tag, the REM pod only and precisely, like as I leave and come back in. I know. Fear box dies after I go get it, even though I will vouch for my life is 100% in that flashlight. Yep. Like, it's going off one by one periodically. I feel like it's kind of just slowly just building it up bigger and bigger until that one moment. Three, two, one. If this is Dr. Ha Ha again, can you say Ha Ha? Are your intentions good? or evil? Do you wish harm on others? Or are you in pain yourself? Why did you want me alone? Ending. Elton, yeah. the flat line noise just happened. It was just another five to 10 seconds of just beep directly below me. And it was right on your last question. It was also the same time the flashlight turned on. I like, as Evan turned the cameras and the flashlight turned on, so he must have been hearing at the same time. Dude. Matter of mind, that flashlight just turned right now. Huh? That flashlight, did that flashlight just turn? I don't know. It rolled. I, I don't know. No, it rolled. I didn't see it. It was pointed towards me. It was pointed towards the REM pod, and now it's pointed over here. What? Am I in my mind did that thing turn? Dude, I don't know. I didn't, I didn't look at where it was set up good enough. Have I in my mind? I didn't see the exact position. I swear, I swear I pointed it right here at, at the REM pod, and now I, I think I swear I literally just watched it roll. I want to say you're right. No way. I'm fairly confident that flashlight just rolls like an inch over this direction. Oh, the other flashlight's turning on. Am I, I wrong? Know. I'm watching it. Yeah, yeah, the other one's turning on. The one in the stairwell. Yeah, your, your light's overpowering it, but the one facing the stairwell just turned on for the first time. Yep.
I can show it on this camera. Yeah. Yeah, I can see it on the door. Wait, you came back in. Uh-huh. Now the other flashlight facing the exit <laughs> is turned back on. Fully on. Fully on now. Evan, if you cover up your light, you can show that one. Right? You can see it? Uh, yeah. What? They just switched. You came in the room and now the one pointing toward the exit. Whoa! Right on you! What? So, so what, what is it saying then? What is it implying? To stay up here? To leave? It's following <laughs> both of us? Yeah, I'll do this. If you want Corey to get the hell out of here, can you say leave? Ending. If you want Corey to get the hell out of here, can you say leave? Ending. I don't know how else to tell you, leave. Wait, you hear that before the leave? If you want Corey to get the hell out of here, can you say leave? I how do did you hear that? I don't know how else to tell you this. Leave. leave. Yes. Ending. If you want Corey to get the hell out of here, can you say leave? That's insane. What's crazy though is the V on the leave. Yeah. You hear the V more than anything else. Leave. Leave. That is nuts. Like, I told you that way, I told you that way, I told you that way, I told you that way. I, you that way. I don't know how else to tell you this. We. What was that? What was that? What was what? What was that? How did that happen? Is that you? How do you do that? What? That. What? What's that? There a bee in here? A what? Is there a bee in here? A bee? Yeah. No. How'd you do that? It, it was like a static or like a wasp or it was like a zzzz. No way. You just heard that? Do you remember like months ago, the one and only time I've ever heard that, that's what I heard in my ear. It sounded like static. Like, it's not like if you're wearing headphones and it goes static and it's yeah. buzzing. I heard it in one ear. Did you just hear it in only one ear? No, I heard both ears next to him. What? Right next to Evan, to his left. I did not hear that. That's... You didn't hear it, Evan? No. I think it says evil right at the end. Are your intentions good or evil? Do you wish harm on others or are you in pain yourself? Why did they walk me alone? Do you want to try again where you're in the bottom of the stairs? Yeah. And see? Because those, like, those are genuinely pretty... Clear ones. I know. Okay, let's try the same thing then that we did before and see. Right. It sounded like you were acknowledging that you're evil. Do you choose to be this way? Or do you feel that you need to be? Did something terrible happen to you? Did you do something terrible? To others? Are there others in this building that have had terrible things done to them as well? Ending. My mouth just got so dry. My mouth just got so dry that my lips are chat again. No! Turn left! Turn! Turn! Whoa! Whoa! Dude, I just saw it rolling. Yeah, and I have a body camera on it.
My mouth just got so dry that my lips are chapped again. No, turn left, turn, turn. Whoa. Breached the doorway. What? And then it kept rolling. Dude. This is it going, I don't know how else to tell you. Leave. <laughs> Does you, it not want me in here? It might just, it seems like it only went because you both came in. Uh-huh. And the second Evan went, boop, it turned on. And the second you walked in, it was like, all right, how else do I make this obvious? Push the flashlight. What? And early we got push. It just rolled, dude. Dude, we just caught a flashlight rolling on camera. Second time as well. Oh, and the other one's on again. Again, that one hasn't been on the entire time. I just want to point one thing out. I don't know if this is a good thing or a bad thing, but for me, it's a good thing. Uh, the more we ignore the instructions, the crazier the activity seems to be getting. March, April next year, for all of you to come investigate. Oh my God. As we're talking about getting it open, do you want us to open this place back up? Does that make you excited? How long has it been since that's well off? Like an hour? <laughs> yeah, since I walked back in. Are you excited? To have people in here again?
Psych, got your bitch back. <laughs> what? <laughs> I left and it stopped. You left and it completely stopped. <laughs> what? I don't get it. I can't figure this one out. Exactly, because you came back in and then now it's 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 still completely done. Like a ghost playing hard to get is like kind of like a double entendre. <laughs> Like, you're hard to get, and now you're playing hard to get? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, why are you gonna play hard to get when you're hard to get already? So, it just went off 60 times. As soon as you take one step out the door, it completely stops. Maybe, like, I'm a ghost and it thinks I left. Or maybe it's being like, yeah, you idiots, just leave. That's why I'm making this go off. Do you think, they, do you think the ghost can hear me? I think the ghost can see you. You think so? You don't think it can see you? I don't think it worked. I don't think it worked, dude. How did you trip over the only thing in the entire room? <laughs> Doctor, surgical, medicine cabinets, and then... Here you go. Yeah, dude. With us hearing that beat, bro, it had to have been calling us to this room. Yeah, so surgery here and the one below, again, is a different kind of medical floor. And then basement is still like the worst, in terms of health condition, the people in the worst conditions were in the basement. Oh, that's interesting. That's very interesting. What? Someone left flowers here. What? See? Like someone like left flowers. Which means someone else had to have found, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, so, someone must have been connected with a spirit here to bring them back flowers. That's what we did at Norwich. Yeah. We brought flowers at Norwich and I think one other spot. So that's, that's super interesting. So maybe we set up in this hallway then and not just a surgical room. Okay. That way. Cause this makes it, you mean like, something must be here. Yeah. All right, I'll just try to set up the camera if I could. Arrived. 11 arrived. Southern. 11 arrived and then Southern. What's about to get Uh. Let's find out, contestant number two. It is a desk with a foam hand and file cabinet. I see water damage, so it makes me cautious. Another desk and another file cabinet. So, there are so many rooms. The foam hand is weird. But, I guess, oh look, more flowers. Corey, I found more flowers. What? Yeah. I got three flowers here. Flowers at the end, flowers in the middle. Like the whole hallway is lined up with flowers. It just said, known, thank. Why is there flowers? Known, thank. So the spirit here that has had flowers brought to them, we'd love to talk to you tonight and learn your story. Maybe we can bring you back flowers one day. It's just so wild we haven't heard that beep one time. And we heard it so many times upstairs. All right. Hey, at any point tonight, if there's any kids on the stairs that still want to play tag, just touch that box that I just sat down on the steps. Are right, you? 
Elton. What'd you ask? I just said if there's any kids running up and down the stairs that want to play tag, just touch that box. We'll still play tag with you tonight. Where is it? Hey, I'm just, we're, I just wasn't expecting him to be like, yeah, dude, let's play tag now. <laughs> Listen, I'm going to move the box going down the stairs, okay? I need you to still touch this box and make it go off. If you want to play tag, okay? Just touch the box. We're gonna investigate up here for just a little bit, and then I promise at one point tonight, we will play tag. You just heard that? Mm-hmm. Upstairs? Mm-hmm. Cat, Cat ball behind you. On the ground. Look right, look right in front of you. Down. Yep. You moved the REM pod and he goes, what else do you want me to do? <laughs> that? I know. What else do you want me to do? But then the boom It's upstairs. like, dude, I want you to play tag. <laughs> I just still can't wrap my head around how do you play tag with a ghost child? <laughs> like this. You're it. <laughs> No fucking way! No fucking way! He tagged you back! Was that, is that you were standing next to it? I was standing in the corner. He tagged you back. Dude, I moved it to going down the stairs now. Fuck. Okay. Alright. Damn it, I made a promise. I have to do this, guys. Okay. All right, here we Wait, go. Here's how you can play. Here's how you can play. Take the box with you. Go like basically hide somewhere with it. What? what? Cat ball just went off on the back. On the back table? Oh yeah, back there, dude. Back there. Oh, I'm gonna tag you. You can't hide from me. Hear it. Come touch this box when you tag me. This is really happening right now. You can't get me. <laughs> no way this is happening. I'm on high alert watching for everything. You can't tag me, can you? I'm untaggable. Tag him. He's too cocky. Just touch that box when you tag me. Right here, brother. Guess they don't want to play anymore. You literally tagged him down there. That didn't go off anymore. No, all your running vibration, nothing's like it didn't go off. It stopped after. Yeah, that? it has not gone off since. No. You, dude, you probably scared the shit out of this kid. The kid's like standing. You're just. <laughs> <laughs> the kid's like. <laughs> Did I scare you? They wanted to play tag. <laughs> I won. <laughs> they wanted to play tag and he played slap the fuck out of you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? no, get, go, go, go. <laughs> tag. Did I get him? Oh man, I was hoping that box would go. Wait, you're saying I didn't tag you? Tag. Tag! 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 You're it! Get the f out of my way! You're it! The cat ball's going off. <laughs> I just hope at any point Evan can just kill his light and terrify you. I know. 
Oh, too easy. <laughs> what just happened? Too easy. I just, I can't wrap my head around the fact that you just tagged a ghost child. And I won. You forgot that part. I won. I wonder if the person upstairs maybe is the same person at all. What do you mean? Set up the flashlight on each end and see if like, wow. ma imagine they run from one to the other. Run it. That's a good idea. I'll try. Yeah, that cat ball's not gone off since you offered to play tag. Yep, yep, yep. <sighs> no big deal. No big deal, just tag world champion of 95. Hey, who's on this floor with us? What's your name? Hey. You're the nurse? Where's the nurse? Is that what it said? Hey, nurse. It, it's hard to see you. Nurse again, right? Holy nurse. sh... Yes. And it was the same voice. Whoa. What'd you hear? Why'd you kill me? I heard, why'd you kill me? Did one of the doctors kill you here? That was the same voice saying nurse earlier. What happened here? What brought you here? Flashlight. Where the flowers are. Who are the flowers for? That sounded like I'm hurting. I'm gonna try carrying it. Or maybe like getting it in the right room. Yeah, will make maybe. a difference. Yeah. This would be a crazy way to play tag. If we find you, tell us, you know. Yeah. If we find you, let us know. We'll keep playing tag. Clever. Run. Run. Are you in this room? What happened in this room? God, I wish I could hear it just a little bit clearer. Where's the kid that wants to play tag? You know what floor he's on? Sorry, what was, that? was what? Someone else in the building. What, what do you mean? mean? The building should be locked. Someone else in building. What'd you hear? Who else in building? No, REM pod would have gone off if you walked up the stairs. Well, maybe not yet, I kind of kick it. What'd you hear? I thought I heard someone trying to sneak up on us. What? Remember earlier when you were like, 
well, sneaking around and he stepped on the water bottle. Uh-huh. I thought I heard like heavy steps and then someone kind of like crunch on something. But now that I'm looking around, there's nothing to crunch on. I guess that. Or that. You actually think it was a person? No, because the doors are locked and we have like security like right at the door. Yeah, maybe turn this off because I was like, oh, someone's walking up here right now. Wait, let's just go just like 10 Cat ball. Is that you? Were you trying to sneak up on us and tag us? Cavill again. You gotta be more quiet if you're gonna try to sneak up on us. Sorry. You almost tagged us. That was a footstep. Yeah. That was a clear, that was loud as fuck. That was a... Mm-hmm. Are there multiple kids up here? Three sets of flowers, three kids. Hmm. What was that? What was that? To shake the building? Okay, that was actually... To shake the building? A concrete building. Boom. I'm gonna go listen by the stairs. Flashlight, wow. Cap all two, both. Should we form like a wall? So that way they like, if we go to tag him, he can't get past us. <laughs> yeah, just yeah, link arms. Both off, dude. He went quiet. He was like, I'm out. I'm out. He said, I'm out. Damn it. He said no. <laughs> known Rocket. Are you known as Rocket? Wait, the kid that wants to play tag is known as Rocket? Is your nickname Rocket? What was that? That's the light bouncing off here. The red light? Uh... Is there a red like point of laser light? That's what I just saw. No, no. I not. just saw a red point of laser just go. No, there's no red. The only thing would be that REM pod, but that's not pointed at us. In the third movie. Whoa. Did you just see that? I'm seeing sh now. It looked like a picture was just taken down there. I swear to God, at the very top right of the ceiling, way down there, I just saw. Can you do it again one more time? He knows we found him. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa, look at that. Cat ball again. Cat ball again. We're coming for you, Rocket. Here we come. Ew, that's, I don't like that. Uh, here we go. <laughs> yeah. We're going to you, Rocket. Here we go. Wait, hold on. I'm going to turn this on. So that way if he says anything. Watch that flashlight turn on now at the end of the hallway. <laughs> Where are you, Rocket? Both! 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 Ready? Tag! Dude, these are two completely different devices and how they function. I... One's force vibration and one's energy, and they both go off at the same time. Rockets right here. Wait, dude. Tag. It's a hand. <laughs> it's a hand. No way. Yeah, look, it's a fist. It's a fist. It's that. Wait, was that tag? The only hand in the whole building was like, come. That's, that's what we needed to. Wait. wait. Tag. You're it. 
If you want to play tag some more, just touch that box that's on the stairs. What is happening? Dude, I heard the same thing. What is happening? Are you are you surprised that we can play tag? That we can talk to you? Flashlight and cat hole again. Is this weird for you? Are you not used to people being able to play and talk to you? Both again. Hey Rocket, do you want a snack? Okay, turn turn those both off. And then I'll, I'll name some snack. Oh, dude, other side, other side, other side. No. Other side. He wants to play again. I literally said it. What would happen if he ran from one to the other? He wants to keep playing. Hold on. Let's see what happens here. Go. I'm coming, Rocket. You know that game where like you play like the cat in the middle or whatever, whatever it's called. Yeah. You like throw back and forth. Dude, we tag him over there, and then this one goes off. And the other set of flowers. All right, you ready? Fair is fair. I'm, I'm going to tag you. I'm, I'm going to get you. No. No, I'm, you, have to, you have to turn it off when I get you. Those are the rules. Those are the rules. That one. Tagged ya. <laughs> Dude, I'm like, <laughs> we go to leave, and then sure enough, this one goes off, and now it's like, ah, going back and forth. I know, but it's crazy that you called that with the flowers. Yeah, it's, it's three sets, yeah. and the speakers buy the third set. Now, yeah. if you want us to come get you again, run all the way over there and turn that flashlight on. And we're going to come and tag you again, okay? <gasps> oh, look, dude, wait, it's switching. It flipped. It flipped. Done, and that one just turned off for a half second. Okay. Wait, that's actually like, imagine if you really ran from there to there. That's, that's rocket. Like, think about how, like, how fast you have to run. It's pretty fast. If I didn't have this vest on, I'd be like, how fast could I do that? Dude, we gotta go tag him again. He turned it on. I'm about to tag you. Don't be mooing. I'm about to tag you, baby. That's right. Ready? And tag. Dude, on, on, turned on. Instantly. No. Instantly turned on. No, it did. Yes, it did. Yes, it did. Instantly turned on. Corey, that was within like a millisecond. You said tag and went on. <laughs> what? I literally turned to you and I remember that with the body camera, so I turned back over, but say, dude, that was like, holy sh. Okay. I. C I guess you're the tag champion now. Does that make you happy? You beat us. <laughs> oh my god, that looks cool. What? That looks so funny. What? With my hand in the- Oh, the POV of you go. Do you have a K2? Uh, yeah. POV go hunting. Oh, oh. No way, it's right. Red? Dude, it was sitting on red, sitting on red! You found him! Evan! He found him! What the heck? Where, like in the fog cabinet on the floor? Nope, oh, gone. Red again. What? Red again. Whoa! Dog. <laughs> Evan's like teabagging him right now. Evan! <laughs> like red. Red. <laughs> red. <laughs> this way, let's turn the body cameras off. What? 
That maybe has it. I don't think so. Can you open that door all the way? Oh, shit! Dude! I just drink so much C4, so much caffeine to my system right now that I am ecstatic. Oh my god, the door is fully opening right now. Come on, open it all the way and we'll go in there. We'll go in there and talk to you right now. Can you open it all the way? Do you see this? Yeah, I see it. Come on, Move push it open. Door. As Move hard as you can. Door. Whoa, dude, that's so crazy that this camera turned off on my chest. And then that door starts opening. Yeah, that's wild. That is insane timing. Wait, what is in here, though? What do you mean? In this. Oh, what did I find out? Is it drugs? <laughs> drugs. <laughs> what is in there? Oh, I didn't turn it on. I did not alt, dude, I just carried it in here and sat it down. Dude. Can someone at the end of the hall please show up? These are oh, there's someone here, at the door. No, nope, hey, you went right, no, no, don't go that way, don't go that way, you're gonna cross it. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Oh, it's the left side, I'm wrong, it's a mirror. There's someone at the door. Watch them start dancing to the music. Do you like the music? Whoa, look at them, they're like reaching over the whole door frame. What? Whoa. That's a, that's a pretty big figure right there, look at that. Look at that. Holy shit. It's stretching across the entire wall. It's climbing across the wall. Whoa. Was this your bag? <laughs> Whoa, look at that. Whoa! 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 Wow! It's higher than the door. It's like on the ceiling. It's crawling above the door frame. And it's gone. And it's gone. Oh, and it's gone. Is that right? Oh! Where'd you go? What? Something just crawled across the floor. On the SLS? Yeah. That was cool. It ran across the floor, dude. Watch there be something in the elevator shaft. Oh, that'd be nuts. You know that's actually something that happened here? What? Someone was killed by this elevator. What? Yeah. How? Uh, the doors. The doors closed on them and uh, got them in between. Wait. So, stuck in the door, elevator goes down, that's like, there's actual documentation of that. No folklore, no, it's it's a real thing that happened in here. He, he died like in this elevator shaft, like. What? Yeah. Go to the basement and do a Panasonic and then got, come back got, and meet got, us. I got something here, I got another. Man, dude, yes, Les is loving this floor. Yeah. Is that the giant one? Pretty tall. Actually, it's more like kid height. Hey, can you wave to us? Hi. And gone again. It's so weird, they're like slowly showing up. No way. What? Now the, the light that you handed me is completely dead. Do you have something on the floor in front of you? No, like, SLS-wise. Oh. Whoa, is it grabbing? Wait, hold on. Which hand has the uh, the light in it? The left. Hold it up. Cool. It's grabbing onto your hand. No, it's not. Yeah, I can see it. So it, it just drained this. It's grabbed onto your hand, right, and it's gone. Oh, wait, that's actually really weird. Look, do you see that? Oh, it went away. 
It's the first time I've ever seen the thermal part of this actually map something out. Really? Because normally it just like does a stick figure, mm -hmm. but I actually on the thermal I could see a dead spot, like a cold spot in the room. Still? And it was No, it's gone now. That was really cool. Yeah. <clears throat> I think it just drained this. I think I could do this is the light you just handed me. Yeah. I keep getting jolts of SLS activity like running across the floor. Still? Yeah, it just happened again. It's happening extremely quick. Almost like a like a scared raccoon. You know what I mean? Like running across the road. Mm-hmm. It looks like it's just going thump across the across the rooms. Twenty of the spirits or entities that can hear us and that are on this level. We set up two boxes. One down this side of the hall and one down that side of the hall. Can you please walk in front of the box or try grabbing it to let it go off and let us know which side of the building we should walk to to find you and talk with you. I have someone here again and I also realized that's where I left the bear. It's like grabbing onto the bear even though the bear's not on right now. Is it? Yeah. You see? That's, that's the teddy bear right there. Did you just hear that down there? What? Scuffling. Basement? It was... Basement or here? I heard it down there, just straight. Oh, on this floor, okay. What was that? That was inside. Yeah, that was, a, that was a human voice. What was that? Do you want that bear? Should I turn the bear on for him? Yeah. Here. I'm gonna turn the bear on for you, okay? If you touch the bear's head, he'll light up pretty colors. It's really cool. Is there anyone on this floor that wants to play? That's you, that's you. We were yeah. playing tag earlier. I guess I'm gonna play. The bear goes off at the same time as the SLS. That's, that's pretty top notch stuff there. weird it's kind of like reaching for you for me yeah can you grab the bear if you grab it really hard it'll light up I don't know if you want that to happen or not if you can make the bear light up you can keep it I'll leave it here for you Hmm. Nice. The whole hallway is now a boop and a trap. Yep. I'm gonna do stairs again with the REM pod. Cause that worked for you last time. Are those green lights moving? Where? Okay, are they like? No, they should not be at all. That's that. That means there's a. Shot. Wait, they are right. They're like squeezing together. No. Look at the floor. The lights on the floor don't look like they're pulsating to you? No. Uh-uh. Actually? Evan, to you at all? No. It, it, it looks funky. It looks like, to me like they're pulsating, like they're doing like that very slowly, like a heartbeat, you know what I mean? Like a heartbeat yeah. kind of boom. I don't see it. And the best thing I can describe it, the light. And the best thing I can describe it, the lights look organic. Okay. 
Okay. Oh. So we can go set up there. Can I just go look through the door? Yeah, go for it. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah. You can go in there. It's just construction material for the roof. Because what the f was that? No one. There's no one. That was weird. That was super weird. Is there anyone in this hallway? Those lights really don't look like they're moving to you? No. That's so crazy. They look like they're moving like back and forth, like like flowers, very softly moving in a, in a light breeze. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I don't get that at all. I just see them. What, what floor? floor? Do you know? Do you know what went on in this floor? Anything? Uh, so originally this would have been so, right? Ambulances, emergencies down below. Mm -hmm. Stagecoaches, things like that down below. Did I just hear my own echo? What'd you hear? A voice. Down below. That's weird. Um, Sounds like it's messing with you. So this would have been like medical. How did my flashlight just turn on? <laughs> I don't know. How did my flashlight just turn on? I don't know. It... Anyways, this would have been like main check-in, things like that. You know, gotcha. like level, and then even afterwards, it stayed kind of like that. So, super sick down low, but these would have been the examination rooms. Then they would decide where do they send you, up or down. Stairs. No. Stairs. Stairs. Do you want Elton to go all the way? Back upstairs by himself? Is that why you touched the box? Or do you want Elton to play with you on the stairs? Tag. It's Rocket. It's Rocket. Do you want to try and do EVPs on the stairs? Run it. Great idea. Rocket, do you mind trying to talk to us so we can get to know more about you and why you're here? We're gonna sit down on the stairs with you, if that's okay. You don't have to run, we're not, it, it's a timeout right now, it's a truce. It's not a game of tag right now. All right, Rocket, let's talk real quick, okay, bud? Whoa. What? This was saying stuff. My name is Harry. That's what it just said. Harry Rocket? My name is- I've seen that category. Harry Rocket! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Harry. Is your name Harry? Let's find out. Yeah, Rocket, name could be Harry. All right. Boy, it really could be. <laughs> Nickname Rocket, real name Harry. Harry, Harry Rocket! Rocket! <laughs> Did you give yourself a funny nickname? He's the hairiest rocket in town. <laughs> and the fastest. Harry Rocket? Ah! He got us. That's either his name or he just like pranked us. Yeah. <laughs> you know? that, was, dude, that was like a three hour play. <laughs> nuts, geez nuts. Mm -hmm. Harry Rocket. Harry Rocket. Okay, but for real, but for real, for real. Is your name actually Harry? Do you actually have a nickname? Edward. Edward? Edward. Is your name actually Edward? Is that what you're saying? Harry the joke? Okay, wait, I need you to stop touching it for a second, okay? Just stop touching it for one second.
Is your real name Edward? Touch the box if your real name is Edward. That? Yeah. Hey, Harry. Is that actually your name, Harry? Or are you just making a joke? Be fearful. Who is Edward? What do you want us to be fearful of? I'm right next to you. What'd you hear, Evan? Like a... I heard it too. As we get, I'm right next to you. Ending. Wow. That. that. You hear a real world knocking, then the device goes on right next to you, and then this. Okay, here, wait a second. We're gonna try to see if we can hear you talking through this. No, we know you're right here. We get it. We know you're next to us. Mm-hmm. You can move away from the box now. You don't have to keep touching it. You can wait a minute. It's okay. Is, what if this is like another like leave? Like be fearful. Like go. I'm trying to tell you to get away again. Let's find out. Be fearful is that. Dude, what is with this? Da, 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 that's, I'm wearing gloves and mm -hmm. I'm not moving. Mm -hmm. What is this tapping that we're hearing? I think it's them trying to turn the devices off. This, this is new. We've never yeah. heard. I know, but that was already recording when it was in. Yeah. So they must have turned it on. So now they're trying to turn it off. I think they're it's just such playing. a crazy sound. Like, da, 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 da. And it wasn't bad. It never no. went off. No. Can you do it one more time? Just the beginning? Play it again? Yeah. yeah. And even that whisper. Dude, it literally goes da 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 and then goes right to there. You still in here with us, Harry? That's insane. You know what's also a weird thought? Hmm. Like, Erica. Erica. Instead of it being like, okay, it could be turning it off. Mm -hmm. What if the other thing is that tap, 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 tap? It's like, imagine if like the veil was a piece of glass between us and them. Oh. I see and and it's them like trying to go like tap, tap, tap. Yep. Like they were literally hearing them try and. Mm hmm. That's a weird theory. I've never heard the taps. I've I know. never heard the taps. Neither, neither have I. But, like, you know how in movies when someone becomes a ghost in a movie and they see, like, their friends, normal people, and they're like, hey! Yeah. Hey! They, like, yeah. walk right through them. Could be like that, like you're saying. It's like a veil yeah. on their side. And they're trying so hard to grab that, but it just can't. Yeah, they're because we're getting a lot of whispers too, like a lot of like getting a ton of whispers. The whole thing just crashed. All the words went away. It froze.
Yeah, it completely turned off, yeah. Oh yeah, it turned off. Yeah, it stopped. It's not doing the scanning feature anymore. Yeah, dude, let's do it again. The tapping noise that we're hearing, if that is intentional, can you tap as much as you possibly can right now, as loud as you can right now? Where in the building should we go? How old are you? Alice. Are all of these names people that we hear? All these names of people that are here on this floor. Who's your best friend here? Ridicule. Do people make fun of you here? Harry Rocket? Is that why you had to come up with such a cool name? Yeah. Harry Rocket? The tapping noise that we're hearing, if that is intentional, can you tap as much as you possibly can right now, as loud as you can right now? Loud as you can right now. Whoa. That was a good talker. What was that? The world. Me. I don't know. It could have been laughter. Like, yeah. That's yeah. That's kind of what I was hearing. Yeah. Thanks. 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 <laughs> Dude, that's a cool name, Harry Rocket. It is pretty cool, Harry. I gotta give it to you. Imagine opening tours here and being like, yeah, there's Doctor Hobbs, oh, there's a boy named Harry Rocket. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, I could. Like Harry Rocket merch. Mom! Mom, I saw it! I saw it! What did you see? The Harry Rocket! We're never coming back here again! Who was your tour guide? Who was he? He was a 33-year-old man with a beard, and he showed me Harry Rocket! He was like, watch this, kid! He chased, watch. He chased me! <laughs> Harry Rocket chased me! Okay. He's like, all you have to do is say it three times and Harry Rocket will show up. And I did it, I did it, Mom, I did it. I said, Harry Rocket, Harry Rocket, Harry Rocket, and boom! It was right in front of my face. Oh, there's no way a Rocket could be a last name. No, it's a nickname. Well, I mean, Rocket probably could be a last name. Have you heard of it? Johnny? Johnny. <laughs> Shut up. Come on, dude. It definitely could be a name. You never heard of Johnny Rocket? You're right. I like the toys. I like the toys? I like the toys. These are toys. Yeah, you like all the toys we brought? Oh, earlier. Didn't we get toy earlier? Did we? Yeah, I brought in the ball. I set down the yeah, ball and it said toy. toy. Yeah. And now these are the new toys. They played with everything. Like the rope has gone off, the REM pod's gone off, the SLS, yeah. cat balls, flashlights. flashlights. Everything has gone off tonight. Like every single thing. You're right. I mean, even the Phasma box we've gotten stuff. This we've gotten stuff. Spirit mm -hmm. Talker, Obelisk, like. No. Literally You're everything. Right. We're batting a thousand right now. Every single device has gone off. Oh, except for the bear. Yeah. The bear. Wait, that's a that's a good point. Let me go get the bear. Go get the bear. Oh, it's in your hand. I was like, no way. Sorry. No, it's okay. Don't don't say sorry. Don't say sorry. It was my fault. It was my. I want you out. No, we just got here. Stop. This whole thing is lit up right now. No, it didn't. Yes, it did. It did. Yeah, the whole thing went. Look at that. Ain't for me. Whole that's, thing went boom. That's nuts. I think that was Harry, or it could have been someone else, but someone said that they liked the toys we brought. Charles. Charles. We're getting so many names. names. Nothing but names on this level. For anyone, we just set a teddy bear on the stairs. And the first person to touch the teddy bear and make it light up wins the game, okay? She doesn't like you. Okay. <laughs> 
Never mind about the game then. Who's she? A yeah. nurse? Oh, dude, that would make complete sense. Think about it, a nurse not liking us, we're like bothering the patients and like distracting the kids and stuff. And playing with Harry Rocket? Okay. <laughs> You're right. You know, when I heard Charles, I was thinking he was setting up for another joke. Harry Charles? Harry Rocket and Charles Dickens. Ch oh. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, I let me, do. Let me guess, the next name we're gonna hear is Richard, huh? Huh? Yeah. Richard? Yeah. <laughs> we're gonna hear Richard Little? Hmm? Mm hmm? Hmm? Is that the next name we're gonna hear? Yeah. Hey guys, if you like the bear, just touch it. I dare you to touch the bear. You won't do it. No luck in the bear. Do you feel like they give us a ton of activity and talk to us and then for some reason they just leave? Yeah. They just go to a different floor. And I also think, again, it was talking about like on the top floor, bring more people, more energy, bring more people, more energy. Mm -hmm. I mean, how much energy, I mean, I understand how tired I get when we do this. Yeah. And if they're only taking a certain percentage of that, imagine how tired they are to get when they already start. Pressure. Yeah. More tired, you know? Yeah. This floor to me doesn't feel evil. It feels like there's just a lot of normal spirits running around Keep waiting. Walking. Keep walking. Which way do you want us to walk? You can either bang on the wall or make something go off, but... I was sick. I was sick. I was sick. Okay, as, we, as we're going this trip, this must be the right direction. Yeah. This is originally where I saw the first SLF figure. Oh, it is? It was right here in, that, in the end of that room. What's in this room? Close. <gasps> no. It just said close. Okay. Yes. Close. Like C L O S E. Yeah. It's a bedroom, I think. No. No, it's not. The room we started in? Yeah. Cement shoes. Cement shoes? Cement shoes? I've never heard that. That's like what you would do to a, like, a mob would do that to something they hated. Like put their feet in cement and then throw them into the ocean and they would just sink. Whoa. To the booth, the next one, and cats. And cats. Operation. Operation. Relation. Relation. Cement shoes, I don't understand. Cement, cement shoes. shoes relation. There's something related to cement shoes here? What? I thought I heard the go. Ding, ding. That was really don't look like they're moving to you? Am I just like, my, my brain just like being fried? They look like they're moving like a light, like a light ripple in a pond. I you wish know? it was doing it for me. It's like a smooth breeze on a summer day. Okay, let's see. We got brought to this room. Yeah. We heard that you are sick. Can you tell I us? Had an injury. You had an injury. Okay. What type of injury? What made you sick? How long were you here for? When it says, how long were you here for? I hear forever. Well, you know what's weird? Oh. When you ask, like, why were you sick? What was your injury? It sounds like it goes, the plague. Which is just weird. Does that make any sense for this location? Would they call that the plague? Maybe. Maybe? I don't call TV the plague. Because if you want to hear it, listen. Oh, did I? Right there. We heard that you are sick. The plague. You know, you have an injury, okay? What type of injury? What made you sick? How long were you here 
It does sound like forever. I know, it does. Wow, that was a fast one. I yeah. died right here. I died right here. Hmm. Like they died even just entering the hospital, getting rushed in immediate. Yeah. Whoa, is that blood behind you? On the wall? What is that? That's a crazy blood splatter. Also, look at these. Look at these little claw marks. Look at them. What? Yeah. Like raccoon? Right? Look. Yeah, but how do the... Can, can raccoons climb walls? No. Those are, <laughs> yeah, those are... Right? All these right here? Yeah, that's what it looks like. That's a tall raccoon. Dog, that's a giant raccoon. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, tuberculosis was called the white plague. No, it wasn't. Yeah, black, yeah, the black plague was way before it, but yeah, also known as the white plague. So we got a direct answer. Yeah, tuberculosis, white plague, and then now you know a year as well. You can gauge that based on the years. Whoa. And the only thing to me is if I died right here, uh -huh. that was where they did TB directly beneath us. Wow. It was like right here below Oh, us. you're right. You're right. Like literally, you I mean like right here, we're only like a few feet off from like where the, the tuberculosis people were put. And I know we can't show it, but we're definitely going to lose signal. That right beneath us is, Eliminate. This, is this very strange like cage system down there. What do you mean? I don't know. There's like a, a bathtub down there and then like a cage. With like chains on it and stuff. You think they would keep people in cages here? I, I can't imagine a hundred years later it would still be there, but it is a very weird room all the way down here. You know when we normally do investigations and we probably talk to like three spirits if we're lucky, like maybe four, but then tonight, the amount of names we got, the amount of different voices we've heard and stuff, it seems like we're talking to eight or nine or ten people yeah and what if the theory is right that because we ghost we started ghost hunting earlier in the day mm -hmm. that all the spirits that were originally talking with us are drained there? there with a question mark there's a question mark there that there that's weird but what if they're tired so they went to bed so then now we're talking to a, a whole new set yeah, yeah. That's insane. It makes sense. Like, look, it makes sense. I've been to like a party before, and I talked to someone for like fifteen minutes. And I'm like, all right, I'm person. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah. all right, guy, cool. Is there anyone else I can talk to you now? <laughs> Same <laughs> thing. They show up. They hear us. He's <laughs> like, dude, y'all suck at tag. I'm going to bed. Your yeah, water well, food is here. Are you staying? Are you staying there? Wow. <laughs> are you Are you there? Are you staying? Wow. Uh, no, I don't. I don't think we're gonna sleep in here. I'm sorry. No. Sorry about that. Let's see. <gasps> well, we do have a portable hot dog. What? What just happened? A nail just went in my fucking foot. No way. Through those. Yes. <sighs> Let me see. Ah. Which foot? Oh my God! Stop. Ah. Stop. It's in my foot. Ah, uh, it's in my foot. Do I gotta get a tetanus shot now? Ready, one, two. Oh my god. Okay. Alright, this is the end of the stream for sure. Oh. Alright. I think we're gonna take that as the end of the stream for sure. Do I have to get a tetanus shot? Um, god damn it. Doesn't look no. terrible. No, you look clean. It's a, it's a brand new board from this window. It just said murder. Did you try to murder me with tetanus? Actually, we're, we're gonna, yeah. Oh, I am so. Did I just ruin the stream? No, 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 no. Um, oh. Where are you from? I'm from Florida. Oh. Okay. Uh, here, want me to shoulder you out? I know. I, I mean, it's, it's it's by my toes, so I can. What? Oh. Ow, it stinks! It was a screw? Yeah, you got screwed. Oh.
we investigated here last night. Yeah. Uh, we didn't even get to the basement or the crematorium. We spent eight hours investigating yeah. and didn't even make it to these two floors. So that's what we're doing tonight, which are... There's what? no way that just happened. What? The door just opened. What door? It's the crematorium. You didn't just hear that? It yeah. just went... Oh, it is. It's open. As you mentioned it, it opens. Oh, it's actually like fully open. It's one foot wide open right now. Let's go back over here. Yeah, that's cool. Let's, let's, step, let's step back over here. Let's get, let's get away from the door. <laughs> we. <laughs> okay. Back. How did that just snap? How did that just snap? I'm not gonna lie, I got no clue. I don't know how, but yeah, I think it just snapped. No, it didn't. I don't know. This is a new one too, it's a brand new one. I'll do it. So the basement where we are right now is uh, one tuberculosis ward when it was in the, the 30s, 40s, which is strange, because again, if you think about tuberculosis, Waverly Hills, if you had people with TB, they always thought like sunshine was a treatment, but we're basically below ground here. And the thinking behind that is they didn't really care. Crematorium, bring them here. One minute walk, they're in the crematorium. And the same ground before this was ever built was an old brothel. A massive brothel was here. So if you know like Shanley Hotel, yeah, Shanley. I didn't know that. Yeah, and then like, so Hill House, which is over there, because uh -huh. Mineral Wells, was like the second brothel. What? So like this was here, and then it got torn down to build this, and then you had the Hill House brothel. Wow. So this ground's first brothel, then hospital, tuberculosis, so many people were dying here, built the crematorium. Wow. Yeah. That so is nice. my idea for down here is I want to turn this into a seance room. What? Yeah, I want to dedicate this entire room right here to seance room. I want to basically put up like a protective entrance. Like a veil thing? Sort of, yeah. And like kind of create like a protection. Like you enter here, mm -hmm. anyone or anything that you communicate with in there stays in there. So basically this would be like a one-way entrance. Yep. And then that would be your exit. Okay. So you would enter into here. This room would kind of be enclosed. Nothing can follow you out, mm -hmm. right? Everything, whatever it is that you want to do in here, every tool you could ever imagine would be in here. Yeah. And then when you exit, you say what we need to say. You don't have permission to follow me and I'm here. You exit that way. Oh, that's Because nice. this is ground level, this is brothel. It's also beneath the hospital. It's mm -hmm. in the center of town. So, you gotta have a lot of salt. Yeah. <laughs> You're gonna have to get a lot of salt. Oh my God, is that the tub? Yeah. Yeah, that's the tub right there. That's, the, that's an original tub from here? Yes. Oh my God. And again, like look at where it is in the in the room. Yeah, why is it in the hall? I don't I don't know. Wait, you don't think that would no 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 no. That wouldn't be like a draining tub, right? Because the crematorium's right there. They want No, there is a prep room over there. Oh. There's a massive prep room next to the crematorium that's like a six stall prep room Fuck. where they would literally have space to prep six different bodies for cremation. It's it's huge, like that other room next to the crematorium. Dude, that's so, nuts. I don't know what that tub was for, you know, but it is a, an interesting choice to be in the generic hallway. Whoa. <laughs> what, the SLS is in like a different mode than I've ever seen. It's in like ghost mode. What? Don't provoke us. Don't provoke us. I think he's talking to you. Is that a warning or is that like a... <laughs> no, that was a warning. Wait, no, was that reverse psychology? What do you mean? Like, don't provoke us. And I'm like, well, now I want to. Yeah, of course you, know you want I mean? to. Yeah, of you know course I mean? now you want to. Well, that worked. Wait, hold on. Should we... I'm not. Is that a... Th like, you know what I mean? Is that a threat or is that like a promise? Or, okay, wait, wait. Let me... Okay, wait. Let, let me do this real quick. Mm -hmm. Hello? To all the spirits, energies, entities in here. We were here last night. I'm sure some of you remember us. If you don't, I want you to know that we're friendly. We don't mean any harm to you at all. We just want to talk with you tonight, learn about your story, learn about you. Someone just said to us, don't provoke us. 
Is that you trying to protect us? S H H H, listen. Don't provoke us. Shh, listen. That's so weird. I've never heard that on That's the That's so shh. I've never heard that on the Dude, screen. you just got shushed by a ghost. Were you threatening us in a way? Oh, that's cool. What? There's something in that wall that's like pulling on you. What? I have it on the body camera. Yeah, there's like some there's like something in the wall that keeps like Whoa, did it again! What does that mean? I don't know. That's cool. That is not cool. Are Dude, you behind me? You, you see, like right here? It's like pulling him. You can see the purple there, that's him. And there's something, like look at that, it's like pulling him into the wall right now. Who's behind me? Dude, there's like something trying to pull you into the wall. I don't know what that means. You hear it? You're misinterpreting me. You're misinterpreting me. Art, don't provoke us. Shh, listen. Maybe they're not trying to pull me to the wall. They're trying to tap on me. Dude, am this I- This is weird, dude. I've never seen this. It looks like it's like, the only way to explain it is it looks like it's pulling you into like a portal, like another dimension. Dude. It's like pulling you like a C shape, like this way. Dude. Look at that. My, it, dude, I've never felt chills on my back before. My entire body is goosebumps everywhere right now. It's, it's grabbed onto your arms, by the way. It's like pulling you like an NFL player. Are you taking my energy? Are you trying to take my energy so that you can talk to me? It's pulling you into the ground now. Stop, don't say that. Okay, if you're just under six feet tall, this thing is 12 feet tall. Stop. No, for real. It's that big? Yeah. Oh, shit. What are you doing right now? Uh. <laughs> What's it doing? It's probably for... <laughs> You heard that? They hear me scream. They hear me scream. Did you hear that? Yeah. What's it doing? That's cool. What's it doing? No, it did it, whatever, past tense. What did it do? Stop. Dude, I watched it latch on to you. I'll demonstrate everything. It's gone now. It was like you were standing here. Uh huh. It was like arms like this, pulling you down into the wall. It kept pulling and pulling and pulling, and then you. What the f is that? What was you heard that? I think Evan, did you? Hear it kept pulling and pulling and pulling. And then you. What the f is that? What was you heard that? Evan, did you hear? It pulled and pulled and pulled, and then it got floor to ceiling height. What? And then it just kind of stood there. I'm attached. Did that just happen? It just said I'm attached? I watched it. Grab onto you, grab onto you, grab onto you, get massive. Go here. It disappeared, you showed up, and then it all went away. Did you just watch a spirit attach to me? One way to find out. I don't I don't <laughs>
<laughs> What's so funny is like right before we talked about this, or before we started this, we talked about how I wanted to confine it so that way if anything happened like this, it couldn't leave. Mm -hmm. Geraldine. Geraldine? Yeah, Geraldine. Sounds like an old name. Old brothel. I thought it was pulling away from you, but it might have been. Stop. So it's inside of me right now. Oh, stop. <laughs> okay. Dude, did it get taller after I asked if it was using my energy? Yes. That is a scary theory. Whenever we see spirits, you know, yeah. and they're this tall, and we think it's a little kid, but what if it's a demon spirit that's just lacking energy? And then once it sucks all that energy up, that's when it gets back to big and who it really is. Yeah. That is It's terrible. like Kirby. It's like Kirby. It's, <laughs> <laughs> it's literally Kirby. Oh my God. What's weird is you're displaying is completely normal now. Nothing's grabbing onto you. Like you are perfectly mapped out. Perfect. Did you just attach to me? Here, you know what? I'm gonna walk down here by that box. I wanna see something. <laughs> Whoa, that was cool. What? Uh, <laughs> what? This is, can you go back over there? Use your camera. That's what this just said. That's what we're doing. Can you go back over there? Hold your right hand out. Every time you walk like this, there's something smaller right next to you. There's, there's two, yeah, every single time you walk, there's like two entities. There's you, human you, and then every once in a while I see something on the floor, like lower You're next to you. We're all connected. I'm connected? We're all connected. We are all connected. So is it just saying that if one thing just attached to me, now multiple things are because they're all connected? And that's why you're now seeing multiple. Tell me if it does it again. We can knock. We can knock. <sighs> hey. You know what's so interesting about this? What? If this would have actually broken, you know what I mean? Like it snapped right outside. We would have missed it. If this more. cable didn't catch it, this would have broken. And we never would have had this on camera at all. Because that same thing could have happened, but we never would have had documentation of it. We would have just been walking. We would have never known. And isn't that what happened last night? We went to go use the spirit box, and three minutes in, it turned it off. Yep. What, you think it's trying to prevent us from getting evidence? This place has been unbothered for 40 years, 35 years. You're too, you're too far away for this device to catch it, so if there's anything pulling your energy, I won't be able to see it. All right, I just want to... We're little. That's what I just said. We're little. Look at that handprint behind you. Whoa. Whoa. It's above right? Yeah, but I... It looked like there was like burnt candle wax on the floor. Go into eternity. Go into eternity. If there is something attached to me right now, and you want to let me know that you're attached to me, can you touch this box that's right in front of me? Just touch that box and make it go off. Yo, I'm here and shit back here. Whoa. I just heard a... Right there. Loud as... You, you have both Panasonics on you. You have them both, like, in your, in your jacket. Fuck. Okay. Of course it targets me immediately. Alright, I'm gonna... I'm gonna do a session. Is there something attached to me? What are you? Jessica. Is your name Jessica? 
Why are you down here? Did you work here? Who's standing in the corner? Who's standing in the corner? Bro, tell me you heard that. What the? Tell me you heard that. What? The f was that, dude? Who's standing in the corner? Bro, tell me you heard that. What the? Tell me you heard that. Wait, where did that, did that come from? You or here? I I heard. I just don't know where. I heard it. I have no idea. It was. What did you hear? Was it oh, that? A woman. I heard a woman okay. talking. Dude, I'm down there and I'm saying, what are you? And it goes, Jessica. And then I go, who's that standing in the corner? And immediately goes, hell. That was like, that was real. That wasn't, that was in here. It didn't pick it up. It didn't pick it up. But we heard that real this. world. How did that not pick it up? Dude, this picks creepy. up every, <laughs> creepy. And it said, where are my children? Jessica and Geraldine, where are my children? Oh, wait. And this was a brothel, right? Brothel, I mean, nerf, like every, it's, it's served every possible purpose here. Like, okay. every, everything from experimental surgeries, cutting yeah. edge surgeries, brothel, like, I mean, we're middle of Texas. Yeah. Everything has been done here. So it could even be a patient saying, yes. where are my children? Yeah. Oregon, brothel. Yeah. Which definitely makes sense. Or here, I want to, everyone, uh, right. I'm going to check, it just said morgue. Morgue. Huh. That's a cross. That was their, their morgue. Whoa. What? From the beginning. Shh. Listen. You're misinterpreting me. You hear me scream. Dog. And then that just happened? They hear me scream? I'm attached. Use your... Use your camera, we're all connected. We can knock. That's weird. <laughs> That's weird. Wait, where are my children? Morgue fresh. There was oh. no actual morgue here. They would go from you died in. Wait, are you saying like her children were the ones? They got taken over there and she's here, like passed away looking for them. Some eat. Or brothel. Do you want to try something? Oh, yeah. Can you let's see how heavy this miscarriage. is? Miscarriage. Whoa. What? Miscarriage. Where are my children? Miscarriage. We're a hundred percent talking to a female spirit right now. And we heard, I, I wish we could replay and hear what that was that was said. Cause it sounded like help or scream, or maybe there was like a precise something that was said. But if you want to go back to, to brothel, it's very easy to have children. And then all of a sudden you tell everyone, no, I had a miscarriage when in reality you didn't. And then, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hi. I'm not sure exactly what you went through, but I do want to let you know I am sorry. I'm sure it was very hard, whatever you went through here. Can you tell us what happened to you here? Do you want to tell us your story tonight? Is Geraldine a female name? Agree. Agree. Do you want to tell us your story tonight? Agree. Okay. Thank you. Just to make it easier for you to communicate with us, you can answer yes. 
by making any of our tools go off. Okay. Thank you for listening. Thank you for listening. Do you remember how old you were when you came here? Were you in your 20s? Were you in your 30s? Explain this equipment. Explain this equipment. No way. Okay. That's, so that's a good point. We haven't like explained okay. any of us yet. All that you have to do is put your energy into this rope. Just try grabbing it, try picking it up, anything. And you, with your energy, will make this rope light up. You can make all of them light up at the same time. You can make only one light up, but I promise you it will not hurt you. And this is just to let you communicate with us, okay? That's all this is. And then the box in the middle of the room. If you ever want to give us an immediate answer, if you tap this, it'll go off. And that is the clearest way, if you get that, that means yes. You answer the question, you understand it, you like that. It takes a little bit more energy to set off, but when you do, we will know that it's exactly what you want us to talk about. Did you hear that? No, I'm sorry. Loud ass boom. That was a door slamming above us. As you were talking, directly above us. It was just, dude, that tub weighs like 400 pounds. <laughs> Jesus. Hey, Jessica, if you want to practice, you can practice touching any of these. 12. Why me? Why? Why is happening to me? That's what it sounded like. Third floor. Can you feel us? It just said third floor. Go up. Jessica, are you trying to keep us away from here? I took my last breath here. Be ready in a very male, deep voice. Something gonna happen the later it gets. Still wanna know why you attached to Corey. He's gotta. And then maybe it said go home. Like he's gotta go home. What? What? So there was a female voice and it, and it just went la that's all it did but there is a voice that keeps coming in and it's not saying words at all it's just like <laughs> it just keeps doing that i've heard it like three four times and it sounds like it's a voice everything stops and it's just like <laughs> little girl sings little girl sings i just went la in a girl's voice this just said little girl sings. That's wait, wait, wait. What did you hear? What was the like the burp, burp, burp noise? It was like <laughs> very weird. That. The last thing this said was little girl sings here. I took my last breath here. Can you feel us? I'm gonna give you a bad comparison, but have you ever seen a movie where someone gets drowned? Stop. Right? Their heads underwater. Stop. <laughs> That's what. And what do you It have? sounded like someone trying to talk, but I couldn't make out words. <laughs> like they're getting drowned. What does it say? I took my last breath here. Dog. You also happen to be in the tub. Did someone drown you in this bathtub? Get off me. It just said, get off me. I don't know how. I just heard footsteps through the headphones. It was like, come, 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 come. Am I hearing footsteps in the headphones? Turn around. It said, turn around. Mama. And this just said children here. What? Patricia. 
Patricia. This just said Patricia. So weird, there's like flowers back there, but like fresh, like fresh flower petals. Am I facing the wrong way? Do you want me to turn around and face the other way of the hall? No, it didn't. It just went turn around. Look, it just said look. What was that? What was that? What was that? Did y'all hear that? Please tell me y'all heard that. Did y'all hear that? No. At one, I don't know what it is you heard, but two, nothing was, no sound. It was another noise I heard outside of the headphones and it was a yelp. It went, oh, loud as outside the headphones. I heard footsteps outside of the headphones. That's why I'm like, what the f and then I just heard, oh. it's like, it's coming, like right next to my ear. That's where the noise is coming from. Right next to my ear. No. no it went, oh. No, there's been one pretty loud thud from above us. No footsteps, definitely no yelp. How am I hearing footsteps? Harry. Harry. We just got Harry. Is Harry Rocket down here? <laughs> Yes. I kind of want to go up. Oh, okay. Yeah. Just because earlier, I remember I got um, third floor and go up. And go up, yeah. Yeah. And look at the red light. Look right in front of you. Whoa. Evan, look. Down. You see that? Yeah, yeah. Wait, why is it doing that? Because we're getting ready to leave. And it said, I like the lights. And the one in front of you, I mean, not directly, but pretty one close to you is a red, permanently red light. I mean, something's pressing into that right now. Something is grabbing that. And red is... Stop. My name is Irene. Hi, Irene. Are you standing right in front of me? Irene, we go to leave again. This is last night all over again. Yo, we go to leave. We're like, what else do we do? Flash that off. Yeah. And then, then as we're leaving, as we're gonna leave, like, oh, never mind, never mind. Sorry, 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 sorry. Stop. Let me show you. I know what he this is exactly what happened last night. You know what I feel like it is? What? They like our presence, but they don't want to just talk. They don't want to answer everything, but they just like the fact that we're here and that we have lights. Cause it is pitch black down here. So maybe don't provoke us is actually like, like please don't do that. You're misinterpreting us. Don't provoke us. Yeah, like actually don't provoke us. We're not mean. Like, <laughs> wow. Okay. Um. Every time we go to this, exactly what happened yesterday. How is it still red? I we, we've had this for close to a year. I've never once seen that. It only flashes one color. And it's first. Well, look, 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 it's flickering. It's flickering right now. Oh. Are you showing us that you're right there? Whoa. Whoa. I'm, I'm losing energy. This just said I'm losing energy as it's flickering. And we're both furthest away from where we're originally attached to. Oh my gosh. Do you need someone to stand close to that wall? Do you want one of us to go back by the bathtub? Well, pulled, pulled from you. There could be a portal right there. Yeah, like it pulls you from you on the wall and look at where the red light is. Yeah. That's where you were originally standing. You were originally standing pretty much right there. Yes. And then I had the SLS right here. Yes. And I watched it pull from the wall. I'm in the corner. Direct opposite side, corner of the room. What? 
Is there a portal right here? What is right here? What is this area? Is this a portal? Well, I'm gonna turn my K2 on, but it is. Dead? Yes. I have one more here though. Dude, ghosts love- Man here. Wait. A man's here. I was just saying, dude, I just said, what is right here? Is this a portal? And it goes, a man's here. In the corner. So it's the dark entity that pretty much runs this bottom floor. Can you light up a different area of this rope? We can see that you're grabbing it right here. And I think that this is Irene. But if this is Irene or anyone else, can you light up one more part of the rope? It's insane the amount of female spirit names we got down here also. Like there is no, no. Look guys, look, even if I'm close, look. Yeah. And that is still stuck on red. Yeah. Something yeah. is grabbing. We're going to have to leave. We're happy to keep you company, but we don't want to sit in silence if you don't mind. Now is us being here protecting you from something? K2 spike. No. No, no way. There's a K2 spike on the K2 reader in the tub and the flashlight's not blinking. And I have what? a camera on it, so it, I, I do have a camera on it. And the temperature's raised almost a full degree. When right as you said 52. that. 52.6, the K2 spiked. Was that you, Evan? That was a loud thud. What was that? The K2 spike on the K2 reader in the tub, and the flashlight's not blinking. And I have a camera on it, so I, I do have a camera on it. And the temperature's raised almost a full degree. When I set it down, it's at 52.6, the K2 spiked. Was that you, Evan? That was a loud thud. What was that? That was way louder than the one I heard earlier. Okay, we're going to leave. I'm not saying that in a way to provoke you, but we just don't know if you're still here now. All right, we're leaving. All right, we're walking back this way now. Harry. Again. Again. I'm not gonna lie. I really think Harry is like, dude, I'm back. Remember Harry led us to him last night. Harry Rock. Plans. Plans. Harry's got some plans. All right, we're gonna pack up. Okay. Please be careful here. Thank you. We will. Yeah, it like broke it, it like fried it. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Put so much energy into it that it like... <laughs> it froze it. Oh. it. Now it's fine. That truly just makes me think though that there's like a portal right here. Right there, yeah. And it's just the energy from the portal just, you know, using that battery. Like I wonder if there used to be a well here. Mm. Or, or something like lower that we were not aware of, you know? Oh, like under the building? I don't know, like right there where that area is, that wall is. Opposite. Opposite. That's like a worst nightmare. It was conjured. It was conjured? It was conjured. We just were saying, is it a portal or maybe it's a well? Opposite, okay, back to portal, it was conjured. I was so weird about that. Huh. Was earlier today we were like walking the building, we were like looking at each room and trying to like figure out like, you know, medical equipment goes here, this mm -hmm. goes there. And there's just something about this room. I walked into the room and my brain went, seance room. 
My brain just like came in this room and looked at it and went like, this is the perfect room to hold some form of like a seance or like open it. That's like there's crazy. Just there was something that pulled me in here. You felt the energy. I don't know why, but there was just like, I had that instinct. There was a fire down here, you can see it. In this room? Yeah, you can see the fire. Oh, yep. This yep. whole thing burned. I thought it was just super old, yeah, it did. And it kind of like, there's no history as to who or why or when, and no hmm. one put it out. Like what? the fire department never showed up and put out a fire here. This just happened to have burned one time and it extinguished itself. It never it, left it this did, room? It didn't leave this room, it only stayed in this room. You can see everything it burned was right here. What? But there's no like mattress, there's no pillow, there's nothing that indicates like someone lived here. But it all burned and it makes me wonder if this like, is this like a loftus hall? Oh. Do you know what I'm talking about? Oh, I do. Pat. P-A-T. Like, I wonder if this is like a loftus hall. You think this is where the devil hangs out? No, I don't, I don't know, but like, I'll imagine like it is actually a portal. Something comes through here that's so yeah. powerful. Flames everywhere, but yeah, because it fully put itself out. It didn't leave, and like of course, why would you want to burn down your own? Yeah, exit. Exactly. There's a ball down here. Wait, was that there? And that I was not there it? last night. That mm -hmm. was not. That was down there. That was all the way down there last night. That was all the way down there. And it's deflated. All, all three of us are positive on this, right? Dude. A hundred percent. That's not easy to roll. I mean, I don't care how windy it is. No. You're not rolling a ball 150 feet down a hallway. No. I lost my hair. I lost my hair. I just want to say, when I did Estes downstairs, it said to go to the third floor. This is the third floor? Yes, and the ball is moved to the complete other side. And then he just said, my family's here. So maybe he's up here in the hall playing ball with his family. I want you out. It just said, I want you out. I don't know why, I just got like No way. That was not you. No. That was not you. I also, as I was walking over here, I was saying I was starting to get really nauseous. Really? And I like, felt it like right here, just right in the core of my stomach. And immediately that goes off. Yeah, like that instant, like you got a puke feeling. Ready? Toy. Toy! Yeah, that's a toy. You like that toy? Did that say throw? You just walked past it completely fine. That was, that was not you. Oh. All right, so to get a point, once one of us throws the ball, you have to touch that light on the floor with the antenna and you have to make it go off, okay? One, two, three. First one to touch it wins. First one to touch it wins. That was not one of us. No, what was the rule? Throw the ball and then once the ball is thrown, the first person to touch the antenna gets a point. So they touched it before us. Yes. Okay, y'all got one point. Is this, what? Is this actually working right now? Okay, here we go. First person to three points. First team to three points wins. One, two, three. Shit. I'm gonna touch it. I'm about to touch it first. Oh, I really did get that one. Yeah. That is crazy. Guys. It is not us getting close to this, making this go off. That is insane.
Okay, it's one to one. All right, Elton, you got to throw it now. All right, here we go. I swear that just said throw it right now. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. All right, who's going to touch it first? I died. I died. Well, shit, Harry. Like, way to kill the game, Harry. It worked for the first one. That's Elton. Elton got that point. You're next. One, two, three. I think I won. I won! Justin Bieber. <laughs> it did not say that. Could you imagine? I'm a believer. I'm a believer. I don't think they want to play ball anymore. Because it kind of went from playing ball to, to you're going to die. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna roll this all the way down there, and I guess if it's back on this side later. But what if it was like the kids getting us to play, and then someone else came in? How did you do that? I don't know. How did you throw it 40 feet forward, but it only go five feet forward? He saw that. Yeah. <laughs> How did you do that? I don't know. Fail. It just said fail. It just said fail. It was a good throw, Harry, and you know it. Kids want to play, but then someone else goes, people died here, what are you doing? True. You know, whether it's to the kids or whether it's to us. True. But it's like, true. What are, what are you guys doing? Like, you know. I heard something Satan. No, don't say that. You're Satan. It gets lonely. See? That's why they want to play. And like, guys, that's what makes stuff like this so hard. It's cause like, it's so hard to only focus on the sad stuff when you are getting act. Where is it? Where'd you put it? That's your REM pod. The stairs. Did that not sound again like you're Satan? Yes, it did. Ghost hunting's kind of against the church. So the fact that we're here doing this, they could be like, you're Satan. Is that right? Is that upstairs or downstairs? It's right here going upstairs. Oh, it's in the middle. Yeah. The no, higher, I... higher up we go, it's, then it's nuns and then it's priest quarters yeah. as you go up higher. So then that would make complete sense why they're calling us Satan. <laughs> because we're... <laughs> Wait, do you think he's trying to get us to go upstairs to get away from these adults that are like, stop hanging out with them? So he's like, come upstairs, come on guys. You want us to go upstairs to play with you? Wait, what the hell? Wait, 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 wait. We're the only ones allowed in this building right now. Why is it shut? None of us shut it last night. No, there was a file cabinet blocking it. Remember? Yeah. Yeah, there was a huge there was a huge file cabinet here blocking this. Wait, 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 the file cabinet's gone. What? Wait, how the f is that possible? Wait, 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 wait. How is that- There was a file cabinet here. This is where the flashlight was on. The flashlight was on top of it right here. No one's allowed up here. Wait, dog, this doesn't make any sense at all. Wait, so what, is, what does that mean? I don't know. And there's no way in hell some kids broke in here and no. carried that down all the stairs. No, it doesn't matter. Our motorhome's been parked here. We've had all the exits blocked off. What? 
I don't know. I'm very perplexed on this one. We were up here like 18 hours ago. <laughs> we were up here 18 hours ago and a giant cabinet is just missing. Yeah. Panasonic? Yeah. Panasonic and then we'll uh, <laughs> push hard. It's gone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't get it. It's gone. I don't get it, but like, there's a part of my brain that goes, I don't, I don't know. There's a part of my brain that just goes, like, there's no rational. <laughs> like, I would, I would be more like, holy shit, if I saw it in the corner of the room. But for it to be completely gone, I don't. You know what I mean? I don't get it. I don't get it. Do you know who moved the filing cabinet? I'm not playing games. Can someone take claim for what has the ability to shake this building? Where is the filing cabinet now? Iris. Are you able to move something else? Whose room is this? I just ended it. You heard that? Yeah. I'm not playing games. And then now all these noises. All right, let's listen. kind of weirder that we didn't get anything with that just because of last night yeah the filing cabinet's missing i asked the first question and it goes i'm not playing games oh yeah yeah like i'm not here to talk to you to fuck around I'm yeah over it today and we got nothing oh look the doors open even more it, right on cue right on right on cue all right, that was weird. Oh, God. Oh. Like, this is, like, this is a completely different feeling from, like, over there. Like, over there, I feel, like, haunted. But in here, it just feels, like, heavy and sad. Before we start anything in here, I just want to let any spirits or souls that are in here, we mean no disrespect at all, and we're only here to talk with you and learn about you. Like this is like thousands on thousands of people were burned in here. Is that Am I tripping? Do you hear that? Yeah, I do. Okay. That, I really I would love to know if there's anyone who has, like, seen another location that has, like, the crematorium still there where you can investigate, but I, I really can't think of any location. Maybe there's, like, a, I don't, I don't know. I just can't think of one. I don't know why. I have, a, I have a very strange feeling that some people were put in there not dead. Mm. Dude, that is Dude, it looks like there's still like ash in there from someone. Stop. Dude, what? Oremus. Oremus. Oh, what does Oremus mean again? Oremus, the invitation to pray. Oh. Which makes sense for where they are. Do you want us to pray for you? That is sad, dude. If they are stuck here, that is insanely sad. This is probably like the worst place you could get stuck in a loop. I just heard knocking on the wall behind you though. And I, I know it's over there. It's just a garage and the garage is completely locked. What?
Well, we did get a few times they communicate through knocks. It was saying, like, listen, we knock. Yeah. I'm just going to knock and let's just be super quiet to see if we can get anything back. Can you knock back to me? Yes, I know you're back there. Do you want to talk? Yeah, I do. What's I your think I heard? The devil? Stop. Whoa, dude, the smell I am getting right now is... I've never wanted to use the word putrid before in my entire life, but that is what it smells like right now. Dude, that's crazy. I, we've been in here for minutes. I haven't smelled anything right now. You heard that back then? Yeah. Is that the smell that you went through? Are you showing him what you went through? I am. I am. What happened to you? Do you remember how you died? I heard a scream, really quick scream. Were you still alive when they put you in there? just think there was a woman in here. What? Hey, I wish I had a heart rate monitor on right now. I'm freaked out. I'm, I'm scared. I'm like, that's that what? what? Dude, there was just someone walking outside. I can't even talk. There was just someone walking outside loud as fuck. And then two seconds go by and you go, is there a woman in here? What just happened? What just happened? The only, the only way I could ever describe that is if you uh -huh. were this close to me, like talking to a point where I could hear you through these. You could hear it over the headphones? That wasn't headphones. That's like what I was hearing in the bathtub. Like I literally was like, I thought one of you were with me, like sneaking up in, like, in my ear, like right in front of me. You heard all that outside, right Evan? Yeah. Dude, there was someone outside just going like this. And then you go, is there a woman in here? I was about to run out the door and be like, what in the f was that? What I don't like is if that, if that wasn't in here, which I don't think it was in here, that means it wasn't recorded, which means, which means only I heard it. Yeah. Dude, they've been doing that a lot today. They're targeting us. That like freak, freaked me out. That was very, very weird. That was like genuinely very weird. You know, like sometimes you've like heard the REM pod through the headphones. Yeah, it was like that. Like it sounded, it sounded like like someone like Ginger, like talking to me. But it didn't, it didn't come in my. Yeah, okay. Could right. you keep, do you know any words? I don't know what it said. It was just enough that it like actually, was like I don't understand what's happening right now. Can you tell us how old you are? Where you're from? Anything about you? Just a little bit more energy. I think I heard Isla or I love. I'm getting that smell again. And I heard devil. Getting that smell again and I heard devil. 
Is the devil holding you here? All the time. What? Is... I just saw an orb. That's gotta be on camera, dude. That was not All the time. What? Is... I just saw an orb. That's gotta be on camera, dude. That was nuts. Is there an evil energy holding you here? Not letting you leave? And there again, I think I heard evil. I wanted to kill. Were a lot of people burned alive in here? I heard the faintest, of course. What was that? Did you see that, Evan? I saw it on camera, yeah. It was <clears> on the <throat> floor. I have no idea. What was that? Did you see that, Evan? I saw it on camera, yeah. It was <clears> on the <throat> floor. I have no idea. What the f was that? Did we just see you? Did we just see your shadow? I don't really hear much now, but now my eyes are watering. No. Holy shit balls, that scared the fuck out of me. That mother just went, you got a demon. That was making me cry. My eyes are watering up so badly right now. <laughs> Holy fuck again, dude, that sounds. That's the first time I ever want to replay a sound in a spirit box, so that sounded like the screams of hell. It was just like, ah, ah. Oh, bro, what the Again, I'm hearing this, ah. Dude, I heard that. I am crying right now, and I don't know why. What? Oh, what did that just say? I just saw another word. I just heard tapping inside of the thing. What was that? What was that? Dude, I just heard behind me. That had to have got picked up on the mic, bro. That was loud. It was. More Spanish. More Spanish. Dude, I can't make some of these out, they're going so fast. I get nothing and then it's just like, nah, nah, and word, 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 word. Who's walking outside? I think it said leave the building. Shine the, the light on Elton again. That was the weirdest thing I've ever saw. It looks like four fingers were under his hat like this. It looked like there was four fingers just spread out like this under his hat. And then once he looked down, it went away. That was weird. That's the devil. Pull him, oh. We should wrap it up. Hey. Hey, man. We should wrap it up. Why? We talking to the devil. The yeah, demon was the one thing I just kept hearing. Yeah. Like constantly I would hear demon. Yeah. And then later be like, demon, mm -hmm. demon, 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 demon. And those, dude, I'm telling you, those, those, I've never wanted to replay an audio clip from a sphere box, other than the, those screams that I heard. What was that? Oh, it was like the little metal. You heard like, it almost sounded like dowsing rods hitting. Ding. Yeah.
It's not like dowsing rods like crossing each other or something like that. Dude, the amount of knocks outside, over there, inside of that, and just on the wall was insane. At one point, I wish I, I should have paused it, but I started crying. It was very weird, like my eyes just like completely watered up and they were just like dripping down my cheek. Mm -hmm. And I don't know why. Did you ever hear this? <sighs> or no? No. Because one second before you go, what was that? And then you continued, behind me outside, I heard <sighs> loud. The record, when I said, what was that? Is because I was, that was, I didn't hear what was that. I heard, I was like, what, like, what was that? That was my real world, I was like, what was, you know what I mean? I couldn't understand what I just heard. It was a very unusual. Something flew over you and we got it on camera. The shadow going across the floor. There's a big shadow flying over you and it was on the floor. Yeah, it just goes right in front of your feet and it's on camera. Can we just pan the room and show like, Sealed up window, sealed up window. There's one window open here, but it immediately goes to someone's house. Like everything's sealed up here. Yeah. Wait a second, I just realized something. They say that the demon in the building is only on the basement level, right? Yeah, they say there's a darkness that lurks through the basement floor. And this is the same level. Yeah. I think it's this thing. Yeah, there's nothing to say it can't go back and forth. There's also a tunnel that connects the two, by the way. No. Yeah, right here on the other side of this. This is the tunnel system. No way. Yeah. So this tunnel system right here goes down and it connects all the way through. So you. Oh my god, it f***ing makes sense. We're idiots. They were doing satanic rituals and sacrificing people. That's why there's a portal and the devil's here. Dog, they would go underground, do their satanic shit underground, whoever it was, and sacrifice alive humans in here. That is one million percent what it is. I think, I'm, I'm hearing like, I just heard the loudest thud sound. Dude, oh my, dude, all the noises we were hearing could have been from down there. See? Dog. So, di so directly where like the tub was that you were in. Yeah. Where you set the REM pod down originally, all the way down that way, mm -hmm. there's a tunnel system that connects from here to here. The thing is the tunnel system is only like maybe that big. It's, it's like that by that, mm -hmm. but. You could crawl. You could crawl yeah. or probably create a pulley system. So if you ever wanted to just get people through secretly. They would steal people from this there, way. transfer them through the tunnel, burn them alive here, do their sacrifices. I mean, this thing is like, it's going off absolutely nonstop right now. Oh my God. Dude. It all makes that sense. That would explain why fresh. Fresh. Fresh would make sense now, why we got fresh. Right after morgue. Yeah. Fresh morgue. Yeah. Whole, that has to be it. Stars. And that is not stopping, dude. That has to be it. What other reason would they burn people alive than a satanic ritual? I think that's what, dude, I think we just solved it. I'm like convinced that's what it is. Do the Panasonic? Yeah. Can we go for the triple confirmation? I mean, this is going absolutely no. Uh, what's behind me? What? Oh, just a hole. Okay. I thought it was about to fall into something much deeper. Here. This is going absolutely nuts, by the way. It hasn't stopped since we brought up the idea of it being satanic rituals and that's what it is with the tunnel. That has not stopped once. See? This is what I'm talking There's about. There's nothing in that. It's literally just a garage on that side that is sealed up. The amount of, dude, if we were, dude, you can ask Evan, bro. There would be times, Elton, where the wall on that side would go like this. Go, 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 Swear to God, multiple times. And then it was outside, and then it was in there. Three, two, one. 
Would they do satanic rituals here? How many people were burned while still alive? Who was doing the rituals? Was it done in secret or did a lot of people know? Would they sneak people in here through the tunnels and then burn them alive? Are the large, loud banging noises that we hear related to some form of a portal? Ending, 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 picking it up. I don't know why there's like a weird instinct that like every time you hear that boom in the building is like some form of a answer or like an energy or something like in the building. Because there was like that, I mean, again, concrete, boom, you feel it, you hear it. Yeah. Yes, they would, yes. Get the f out. What they Yes, they would, yes. I hear too count. many. I hear too many. That was a woman's voice. I hear something, something right. Something, something right here. Is that the door, though? I think it's the door. Yeah, it's the door. No, it's not. The door's closed. Wait, 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 let's do it. Loud portal? Portal. portal. Related to some form of a portal. Loud I heard portal. I heard that. Portal. To some form of a portal. Portal? Dude. Was there something in the middle goes portal something? It's never ending. What do you hear in the middle? At the end it goes, it's never ending. It says it's never ending twice. Oh, it, does? it goes portal something, it's never ending. It's never ending. Switching to the other Panasonic. Run it. <laughs> we have two. Yep. Same same type of questions. So, yeah. Not verbatim, but same type. Yeah. Okay. All right. Here we go. Three, two, one. Were you a part of a satanic ritual? Is there a portal here? And if so, is it used for evil? Would they only sacrifice women and children? Are you saddened by what happened here? Or happy?
How would they sneak people in here? Someone truly was burned alive here. Can you say alive? Did they sacrifice your soul to the devil? Or did they do it for fun and for payback? Ending, picking up the recorder. It is still recording. Let's go. Perfect. Of me getting closer. Yeah, I think I, I, it's low in the middle, so I'll have to crank it up later. But yeah. That's because I set it while I was holding it, and then we backed away. Okay. That's the reason. So I'll have to crank that up in the middle there mm -hmm. to make it match. I, I, I think we put it together, bro. And I think it's insane that we have never once heard a story about any of that, and that's what this is like leading us up. To. Alright, ready? Yep, one final question. If there is something evil here and you want that to be known, can you say evil? If something horrible happened to you here, which has made you feel hateful and evil, can you say, help me? Dude, I think that there are probably hundreds of spirits here. I, I truly think that there are. I think that there's probably some evil ones. There's some good ones. There's some doctors. There's some nurses. There's some kids. There's some patients. There's some parents. And it sounds like there is one demon. That is what we got earlier. We got that there is just one demon here. It's weird because it feels like we're starting from scratch. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. think about almost every location we've gone to, like Waverly Hills, you're like, you already know 502, and you already know like the third floor, mm -hmm. and you already know the body shoot, or you go to Blair House, and it's like this. But it's like, I watched like, watched like the other investigations I could find here, and there wasn't much like information about... What? That was like a... I didn't hear it. You hear it, my thumb? I was listening to you. This sounded like someone was like sitting in the back and went, What? Yeah. I feel like that's a noise a demon would make. I just, yeah. I just, it, you know what I mean? Like every other place, like you kind of already know, like you can go to Shanley Hotel, and you can go to the Stanley Hotel, and you can, right, you can go to all these different places and you know who to look for and what to do, but this place, even as old as it is, other than the only one story that people have encountered is the guy who died in the elevator shaft. Yeah. People have seen him and they know his name because it was recorded. Mm -hmm. But everything else is kind of lost. Unknown. I mean, like, dude, I dug through as many of the records as I could of this town. No one could tell me how many people actually died here. That's insane. You know what I mean? Like, once we started keeping birth records and things like that, like modern history, yes. Mm -hmm. But there's like a 50, 60 year period where this part of Texas like there's no records of anything about it at all. 
Which makes sense why they were getting away with sacrificing people. Yeah. Yeah, and, and like, I also don't know, like, at that time, if it's, like, where that was in American history with sacrifices and, or if it's just, like, you owe me five dollars. Mm-hmm. You owe me five dollars, get us kids. Yeah. You know what I mean? You owe me five dollars, get us wife. Like, I don't, I don't know if it's... Yeah. You're right. Both one way, the other, but you're right. Dude, you're a hundred percent right. It could have been that. It could have been somebody owed someone money. Yeah. So they went and took the wife and kids. We caught inside the wife going, Where are my kids? Yeah. They, that's what I'm saying. Like that's why I'm like asking, like, is it evil? Is it portal? Is it this? Is it manifestation? Right? Like yeah. we talked about like conjuring house. Mm-hmm. For example, we were like, our conclusion is it was built upon fear and now needs fear to exist. Yeah. So same thing, like if doing an evil act creates evil, if energy is always energy one way or another, you do something evil, does it remain as evil? You know, like it's just kind of... Facts, I see what you're saying. So that's what also like what I'm trying to like run my brain through, but obviously it's one night. It could be both though. You it know? could be. The land could just have that evil energy. <laughs> but this is the one time where we like don't have anyone else's past investigation work or reports or evidence to like look at and compare and go, oh, you've also gotten this. I know. So it's a very interesting thing. Like we have our theories and our thoughts, but like it's kind of like scientific method. You need ind- you know, independent other people to confirm it for you, for it to make sense. Yeah. Or we just gotta come back soon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we'll get other people in here. Yeah, seriously. Figure out what is going on here. Seriously. I want to know what's going on. That tunnel system just feels bad to me. It, it, I'm, like, I'm like really like trying to recap everything that's happened here from the top floor to playing tag to mm-hmm. in the basement. To like the, the entity grabbing you. Oh, by the way, before we leave, you should actually be like, hey, you don't have permission to follow me. Facts. Because don't forget about. Thank you. Yeah. Thank Sorry, you. I was thinking about that. Uh, I was Damn. thinking about the fact that, yeah, like that thing kind of grabbed onto you and then- You said, normally make fun of me for doing that. You're actually worried about Well, it me. literally, I watch, I do, I've never watched an entity on the SLS grab you, pull you, and then later you say wall, and then also the device says, I'm attached. Yeah. I've never seen, like normally I'd be like, oh, that's cool, it's trying to pull your energy, but it said I'm attached. So, thinking maybe we should, you know, when we step outside here, you should, you should probably say that, so. That's a good idea. You know what's funny? Remember when you first walked in here yesterday? We've been here for two days now. Mm -hmm. First thing you said was you felt like you needed to cry. And then you cried tonight? And then I cried here and I just realized that. But why do we both feel that? Because the women or children or men that are stuck here are showing us the emotions that they have. And it's really sad. You do not have permission to follow me. You do not have permission to attach to me. You do not have permission to follow or attach to anyone. I'm trying to think of how to word that. I'm trying to, I'm trying to help y'all. I'm trying to cleanse y'all. Do y'all want to get cleansed or no? Uh, I, I feel like they didn't target me tonight. I feel pretty good. Okay, maybe them. Okay, we're back to talking about me now. <laughs> Okay, you must stay here. He's so loud. Dude, I'm pissed. He's so loud. I'm pissed, bro. The whole neighborhood is like... Dog, the SLS caught something 12 foot tall freaking grabbing me and then it goes, yeah. I'm attached. Yeah, you were there for T category. I was. <laughs> Seriously, you must stay here. In the name of Jesus Christ, you do not have permission to attach to me. Till we come back again.